to keep this short. Uh, thanks for coming out and supporting this effort in the cold. Uh, I left my ice fishing stuff at home today. Um, uh, my name is Jim Phillips. I'm a professor of chemistry and I'm president of the faculty academic staff union here. Yes, we have a faculty academic staff union whether it gives us the right to act on it or not. Uh, I want to talk very frankly about the situation here. Um, students and faculty need to get together on this. I believe that we can roll these cuts back if students and faculty are willing to stand together. Okay? We need each other. And to be perfectly honest, faculty and academic staff need you more than you need us. Okay? Uh, Scott Walker is going is to line up and say he's on your side and he's going to extend this tuition freeze. Okay? And he's going to say he's got your back. Okay? Uh, but the end result of that is that your education gets balanced on the backs of, me, of my colleagues and I. Mm -hmm. That is, the ones that are fortunate enough to still have their jobs once this happens. And I am going to lose colleagues if this goes through. That's, 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 I'm not going to sugarcoat this. Okay? And that's not good. Okay? So how do we stand together? All right? What I want to convince you of is that if I get a good deal in my workplace, okay, I do a better job, you get a better education, my life is better, your life is better, you guys get better jobs. That's the way the system works here. And I think for anybody that's here, you can see the benefit that if my workplace is better, that that, that benefits you. Uh, uh, so there's, there's, a, there's a mutual benefit here. The financial part of this game by its very nature kind of pits us against each other and we need to not get sucked into that division. Uh, the guys at the helm here practice a strategy called divide and conquer. They're on record as using that strategy and we need not to get sucked into it. Right. All right? right? Here's how this works. There's, there's three pieces of the financial puzzle in this business. There's public support for higher education and there's your tuition dollars. They go to support one thing primarily, and that's my salary and the salary of my colleagues. Yeah, you got to heat the buildings, you got to buy paper, but if you've listened to what the chancellor has to say, where the budget cuts are are at the people. Okay? So what comes next is people. All right? So the choice is if the public support goes down, either my pay gets to, my pay gets cut or my colleagues get laid off or you guys have to pay more. So where we win in this situation together is by continuing to advocate for more public support. That's the Wisconsin idea. That's what makes things like this happen. Yay. So let's do that, okay? And that's what I got to say. Yay.